So, hello, hola, salam alaikum, um, konnichiwa. In my language, Minglava. I'm so blessed to be here with my brother and sister. Before I met these two of you, my life in Eugene was miserable <laughs> and lonely. And this couple added my life in Eugene different colors. So like they are always ready to celebrate for different things. And when I was having a tough time in my life, given the political situation back home, these two were always with me. I always appreciate that, like, these two are the blessings of my life. Without these two of you, I would not survive in Eugene. These guys mean family to me. These guys mean home to me. And I have a lot of stories to share with these people because like we share a lot of moments together and and I also see the stark difference between the two of them <laughs> I'm not joking I'm serious <laughs> uh, Santi is like a over nice so we call him nice ho <laughs> he's extremely nice to everyone sometimes more than necessary <laughs> Sometimes I'm forgetful to do what I'm supposed to do. Santi would be like, Dude, you know, life is tough. A lot of things are going on in your country. But if I'm not mistaken, we promise to do such and such. <laughs> Santi is trying to be like, beat around the bush and be diplomatic. Be the best friend ever. On the other hand, Nettie would be like, To Diago, you need to do this. <laughs> You know what? That's why I call Natty my supreme leader. <laughs> so most of the people, like some of my friends, so we should call her the supreme leader because she's the supreme leader of our group. So when I think about the love story, the commitment and marriage, I brainstorm what I should speak or what kind of poetry I should recite. If I recite in my language, it won't do any justice to all of you. And I came up with this uh, beautiful book by Kali Gibran, the prophet one. This one is the one of the most classic literature in poetry. I hope you guys might be aware of who he is. I highly recommend to check it out. And I decided to recite a chapter in this book on marriage. Santi and Nettie, you were born together. And together, you shall be forevermore. Santi and Nettie, you shall be together when the white wings of death scatter your days. I, you shall be together even in the silent moment of the God. That Santi and Nettie let there be spaces in your togetherness. Let there be spaces in your togetherness. Let there be spaces in your togetherness. And let the winds of the heavens dance between you. Santi and Nettie love one another, but make not a bond of love. Let it rather be a moving sea between the shores of your souls. Santi and Nettie fill each other's cup, but drink not from one cup. Santi and Nettie give one another of your bread, but eat not from the same loaf. Santi and Nettie sing and dance together and be joyous, but let each one of you be alone. Even as the strings of a lute are alone, do they quiver with the same music? Santi and Nettie give your heart, but not into each other's keeping. 
For only the hand of life can contain your heart and stand together, yet not too near together. For the pillars of the temple stand apart, and the oak tree and the cypress grow not in each other's shadow. Kali Gibran. Um, in my language, I wish in them all the best, and I would love to say only just one phrase. It would be in the words of Gibron, it would be I'm wishing Santi and Nettie all the best. I'm wishing and I'm hopeful that you two would be together when the white wings of death scatter your days. Thank you.